guys, it's me, Gothella, Firefly Parker's evil twin, and welcome to day 29 of October. Today I'm going to be reading to you a, a scary story called The Story of Lisa. It's about this girl who had an imaginary friend named Lisa, and this is her story. And there's even pictures, too, so... See? I'll show you. See. <clears throat> and, and there are even pictures. So, let's see. The first picture says, This is Lisa. She is my friend. My mom and dad can't see her, so they said she is an imaginary friend. Lisa is a nice friend. And this is the second picture. The second picture says, Today I tried to paint, today I tried to plant a flower in the yard. I tried to plant it by the sandbox. But Lisa said, that's where her daddy is sleeping. So I planted in a cup of dirt. And the third picture says, Lisa is at school with me today. I brought her for show and tell. But Mrs. Monroe got angry because she can't see Lisa. Lisa got sad, so she hid the chalkboard eraser. And this is the fourth picture. The fourth, the fourth picture says, Yesterday was my birthday party. Mom bought pizza but no one came. Lisa said people came on the porch and left them and then left. But they left presents. I got three Barbies and some shoes and five dollars. Me, me and Lisa played Barbies. The fifth picture says, Mrs. Monroe is absent today. Our substitute is Miss is named Mrs. Stigman. She is pretty and nice and is letting us have snack time after diary time. I wish Mrs. Digman can stay our teacher. So and this is the fifth and so the next picture says Today Jonathan Parker stole my pencil sack. Mrs. Digman couldn't find it, so she made him give me his pencils. Lisa came to school too, but Mrs. Digman can't see her. But she said she believes that Lisa is real. And to be honest with you, I believe that she's real too. Yesterday, Lisa and I... Yesterday, Lisa and I... Lisa... Sorry guys. Yesterday, Lisa and me went on a long rock until the moon came out. Daddy got really mad and said Lisa is stupid and fake. Lisa got sad and disappointed. Today, she didn't come to school, but Mrs. Digman said Mrs. Monroe won't come back. Daddy was at work all day yesterday. He didn't even come home to eat dinner. Today he is still at work. Mom packed me a pudding in my lunch bag. Mom packed me a pudding in my lunch today. Pudding is my favorite. I love pudding too. I miss Lisa. Daddy is really busy at work. He didn't come home at the weekend. Mom is angry at him. I'm going to write a letter for Lisa. Dear Lisa, please, I miss you. Please come back. I'm sorry when my dad was mean. You are my best friend. Lisa came back yesterday. She said sorry for leaving and I told her my dad won't come home. Lisa said Mrs. Monroe and him are are sleeping like her dad. I hope they wake up soon. <gasps> oh my gosh. <clears throat> and 
place. That was scary. And I'm gonna show you the pictures. I'm sorry, but the pictures won't look on the screen, so yeah. So that was the story of Lisa. I hope you enjoyed that story. And I think I know what happened to her and I, I know what I think I know what happened to Lisa's dad and the girl's dad and Mrs. Monroe. Lisa killed them just like she killed her own father. Oh my gosh, what a twist. So anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Comment down below if you did. And also to subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. Because Firefly Parker would really appreciate it. Like, like, like me. So thank you so much for watching. This is Goth Tala, Firefly Parker's Evil Twin. And I shall see you tomorrow. Bye!